Hey students, Miss Carlan here. How you doing? Surprise! I thought I'd put this on my YouTube channel to help my GCHFA students get ready for their Christmas concert. Okay, so there's two things first I gotta tell you. One is using a metronome because that is going to give you a reference point. So that's really important. And you wanna be somewhere around in the 70 range. So today I'm going to play this under tempo with the metronome at 76, but our performance tempo I'm hoping will be somewhere around 80 to 88. So it is joy to the world after all. Okay, next, some of you uh, did not measure the numbers correctly and so I'm going to show you right now that when you see a measure that has a big fat bar line and a number over it like the second from the bottom here and that big two that means that's two measures rest that you have to count so you count one two three four two two three four okay so there are two measures of rest if it were three it would be three measures rest and so on okay so i'm gonna play joy to the world and this is the violin part but cellists and violists you can feel free to play along with this and your part i'm going to do the whole thing from start to finish including the two measures rest at the very beginning so here we go this is joy to the world at metronome 76. Two, two. And applause. So there you have it. Shut the metronome off now. And I meant to say I started right away. The minute I started the metronome, that was the first measure. And also violins do pay attention. I tried to angle myself so you could see the bow and be able to see how I use the bow. And in measure 16, you have to be ready for those 16th notes going crossing the string to your open A. So keep those eighth notes a little bit on the short side like I showed you. So good luck and I can't wait to hear all the progress.